think, uh, watching. You've said that, stated that the enemy is very wise, very old. He's ancient too. And here we are with a problem of lack of knowledge. Mm -hmm. And we're being faced with this. Mm -hmm. What do we say to people we run into that, you know, you can even perceive that they are dealing with the occult, they're talking occulting, occultish, uh, they're you know, at their horoscope, uh, their every horoscope day. They're they're what did you say it. to them? What, what is something that we can do to protect ourselves or to help them come to Christ? The only thing you can do to protect yourself is by you learning how to work in the fear of God. That's it. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of all wisdom. Yes. I am a man when I got saved, born again, television on this, uh, TBN and all kind of stuff. But hypocrisy was so bad. Abusing my own wife, beating my wife. As a pastor, what's happened? I got attacked back the same demon back in the country that attacked me back in the country. Your, wow. your gift, it wow. does not protect you. No. Your gift does not protect you. No. What protects you is the fruit of the spirit that comes out of you. You will know a tree by its fruit. Yes. Don't let nobody yes. Yes. lie to you. I have seen, I cannot come here and give names. Yeah, right. Struggling with homosexuality. Yes. It's now in the bloodline. Mm. The children wow. in it. And I tell you name, you won't believe it. Mm -hmm. But they're very successful, very powerful. Yes. But yet the devil does not care about how anointed you are. Mm. The only thing he fears is the, 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 the fear of God in your life. Mm. Wow. Something that you just said was so important. I think it's important to say it again. And you said your gifting will not protect you. It's no. the fear of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I think that we have become numb. We've become desensitized to that importance that we really need to fear God, not that he's trying to strike us down and waiting for us to make mistakes, Amen. but that he protects us and Amen he's the only that. one yeah. who and, has and that not, power. And not fear from beating or whatever, but reverence. Yeah, it's reverence a reverential fear. Is, is it's what, it's, what we it's mean. that you love God more mm -hmm. yes. than any sin yes. Yes. that may tempt you. That's why I love you mm -hmm. and your husband, not to flatter you. I watch your relationship with your husband the way you, 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 you're willing to let the gospel go through this television, congratulations. The Lord is going to take you far away. Continue that way. Well, you know, years mm -hmm. ago, you prophesied over us. This was probably, I know, at least 15 years ago mm -hmm. when we first came to the city. And one of the things that you said, and you all love hearing this, <laughs> um, it was back when our very first set in Las Colinas, it was a rented set. It was just one, we were just one channel, <laughs> channel 29. And uh, you said to us, in fact, y'all get tickled, <laughs> Pastor Rahumbe called me a dog. <gasps> yes, he called me a dog. He said, your <laughs> wife is going to be like a dog. Oh. She will see things <laughs> and she will hear oh. things <laughs> before you do. The Lord has put you together That's you know, awesome. to, to That's do awesome. mighty things. Yes. And so that he meant it as a compliment, That's but I good. kid him about it. But um, yeah, but I remember, so I don't know if you remember that, yeah, but you talked about how the Lord would use I us, you know, as a days. couple. If I see the station today where you are, this is just the beginning. He will take you far away. Amen. Yes. Well, stay with us. We continue with Pastor Humbe and our discussion on the occult for a few more minutes when we get back. As the Bible declared in the book of Joshua, chapter 1, starting verse 3 through 9, you meditate in the word, you pray, you take a day that you're going to be able to fast without knowing anybody knowing. And pray and do that, the Holy Ghost will come in your life. That's one of the reasons Jesus came here on earth. We're not going to scare people. We do not share these things to bring fear in your life. You are valuable before God. You are more than gold, diamond, and silver. He want to use you. So the only thing, repent, come to him, follow the teaching, 
and God will use you in the greatest way. Yes. Amen. And in a simpler Amen. form, just say, Lord, I want everything that you have for me. Yes. Fill me with your spirit. spirit. I want to be led by your spirit. And uh, I want to do that that is pleasing in your sight. Amen. And uh, did you want to add anything to yeah, that? And I, I want to encourage you that there are great um, mysteries of God that will re be revealed to us by the power of the Holy Spirit. As yes, we study yes. His Word, He will reveal to us. And he's, He said in a good way, in a great way, signs yes. and wonders will follow those yes, that God believe. He, he puts His super on our natural. Yes, He does. And that kind of supernatural is that God's supernatural is great, isn't it? Yes. That's how we, we were able to build the Daystar Television Network. It exactly. wasn't, wasn't us. It wasn't what it was we did. It was work. yielding yes. to the power of the Holy Spirit. And it changed your life, your testimony. Yes. Incredible. Uh, miraculous. And the Holy Holy Spirit is not just uh, the supernatural wisdom and power, but it also says in the Word, He's our comforter. Yes. And yes. so and all guide. those things and that are tormenting yes. us, yes. He yes. teaches us and He comforts us and He leads us on that path That's to good. get closer to the Lord. Yes. Yes. He, he does so many more things than just the, the power part, which is exciting. Yeah, yeah. But for all the people who are just tormented in their pain and their mm -hmm. sorrow, He really does get mm -hmm. into that place of our heart that Amen. comforts us. Yes, He is the call, us. the comforter, isn't He? He is the comforter. And you know what? He will be there to protect you because He's going to follow God's orders. But yes. you will not get the uh, benefits of the Holy Spirit until you invite Him in yes. and that's learn good. about Him. Yes. Yes. And that's when you want. That Marcus know. preaches a message on Holy Spirit. I love it. And he said, so many of us are like, let's say Cindy's Holy Spirit would say, come on, Holy Spirit. We don't realize he is a divine person, <laughs> but we're not supposed to pull him along. <laughs> we're supposed to get behind him and let him lead us Amen. and he guide us can. into all truth. Amen. And he carries us through things yes. we cannot go through on our that's own. Right. That's good. He does. Well, I hope you've been encouraged today. We're out of time. Again, just pray that little simple prayer. Lord, I want everything that you have for me. And just reveal your spirit to me today. I want to thank again my guests for being here, especially Pastor Humbe. Thank, thank you so you much for joining us. And uh, if you know anyone that's experimenting in the occult or caught up in some of the doorways, entryways that we're talking about, then call the number on your screen. We want to pray with you Hallelujah. and for you and believe that the true power of God and the Holy Spirit can touch not only you, but your family members as well. Yes. Our prayer partners are standing by. Thank you again for watching. Till next time, bye-bye for today. This has been an A Star Television production. Are standing by. Thank you again for watching. Till next time, bye bye for today. This has been an A Star Television production.